Hey guys, welcome back to another video. In this video, we're going to be talking about setting up your Twitch account from scratch, as well as the first five things you need to do to start personalizing your account, moving you right on towards affiliate. My name's Jason, this is the Stream Experiment. Didn't hit him at all. Well, that's not even my head, so you're gonna. That guy was almost dead. He's right here in front of me. Right in front of me. He's in the storm. Oh, there's two of them. I'm almost dead. His buddy's in here with me. Okay. I'm alright for now. I'm with you here. He's behind us. Got him. God, I can't see. Go take all that guy's stuff. I'm just drinking my thing so I'm full again. Alright, first things first. Let's jump on over to the computer here and we're gonna start setting up our account on Twitch. So we're gonna go right up here to the sign up. First, obviously, you gotta go to twitch.tv, www.twitch.tv, or just type in Twitch in Google and it pops right up. All right, here we go. Clicking on sign up. So, this is my sign up stuff here. I don't know why it's popping up there, but we're gonna come up with something new. So, let's do a username. Let's do Harry Mr. Potter. Does that work? Username must only. Okay, so we can't do the period in there. There we go. Hey, it worked. And then you're going to type in a random password. Okay, once that's set up, it's just going to ask you a few questions here to figure what you're into to more so just set you in the right direction on what to watch on Twitch. So you're going to click choose some interests. I like Fortnite, uh, just chatting in Warzone. Cool. But there's a whole bunch of stuff here that you guys can choose. Whatever you like or whatever you're into, whatever you want to watch, whatever you're into gaming, just choose it there. So we're going to click done and that's it. Now I'm just going to hit save and I get out of that. And from here, you're going to want to go right up here to this little icon there. And we want to go to our channel. And that's going to bring up this right here. So Twitch makes it real easy for you. What you're going to do is click on this edit button right there. Customize your stream channel. So we want to go there. Click at it. And then it's going to bring you right on to preferences and then channel. So if you go to right to your, your creator dashboard is what we're in right now and you come down here to preferences, it's gonna be like this, click on there, go to channel and it's gonna bring up this. So step number one, we are going to add a profile picture. That is step number one. So you're gonna click on that right there and then where do we wanna go? And let's do do this picture how it is on my other channel and then you move that around uh, whatever you want to get into it you can zoom in and stuff too if you want to emphasize more of your face or anything like that this will do click save okay successfully updated awesome so now that's done let's move on to step number two getting in a profile banner so you can generate a background or generated background this is what's in there right now I don't know what that is but we want to do custom image and then we're gonna go upload we're gonna click upload photo and then I already have one set up so I'm gonna click on that and hit open and if you want to see how I did this just put a comment down below and then I'll show you exactly how I set up my banner all I did was really set up um, one picture for a profile and then I just cropped it down so that it would fit in there but if you want to see more exactly on how I did that and how I edited this onto it in Photoshop I can show you that as well 
but we're gonna oh, we gotta switch it over and click save so step number three we're going to be editing your video player banner and again this is just in the same tab it's just right below this other profile banner and then we're gonna go down here to video player banner we're gonna click update and then we want to do just the same picture as this one this one was just cropped down I want the full picture in this one click, o click open and then boom you're done in there so let me show you quick the difference between the two so if we hit refresh here the first one your profile picture is gonna go here the second one is this banner right here in the background and then that third one this one here that we just updated the video player banner that's gonna go in this chat so when you click on chat boom it's gonna pop up there all right let's go into number four you're gonna set up your social links so for me I want to direct people to my YouTube channel so I'm gonna put YouTube and then the stream experiment and I don't have anything set up for oop, and then you gotta put something in there for um, our YouTube channel so let's go over here get the link I'm just using my other monitor right now so I'm just copying the YouTube link in there there okay so that's in and then if you have other things like your Instagram so for me it's just Jason Dahlquist and then I would copy in my Instagram there but I have not done that yet on my other channel not that I'm gonna be using this one either but this is just to show you guys how to set it all up okay so for part of this same step and I'll show you here in a second why I link these two together but you're gonna type in your your social media links whether it's YouTube Instagram uh, Twitter or all of the above you can do any of those or put them all in there it's wise to put them all in there so you're always directing somebody towards your content right and it's not just twitch but you're gonna scroll up here and you want to type in a bio so for this I'm gonna type in a little bit about me my name is Jason and I love Harry Potter I bet I know more than you quiz me and I'll get 100 percent cool boom done all right so what that does we pop on over here hit a refresh button when you scroll down on your home page here or when somebody searches you now they're gonna find your bio right on top okay so my name is Jason I love Harry Potter I bet I know more than you quiz me and I'll get 100% and then my YouTube link is right there and your other ones will pop up here as well alright for step number five we're gonna pop over here and we're gonna click this edit panels we're in the about tab so we're gonna click edit and we're gonna find some extensions right now I have the latest followers so if we close the edit panels we have the latest followers pop up now I'm gonna bounce over to my actual account hammerkills20 and show you what I currently have And again these are all free so you can just play around there's a whole bunch of them that you can find so here we are hammerkills20 again this is all the same stuff that I have set up on that other account that I just um, showed you guys how to do but first off just like you saw in my last one we have latest followers so I have 18 followers currently and every time somebody follows me it pops up on here and then I can see that everybody else can see that um, so it's just kind of a cool thing for people who follow me to see their name up there and interact with anybody else that you know I have that follows me so just uh, no transparency right there everybody can see who follows me and who doesn't okay but right here in the middle it's just a schedule it shows me when my next countdown is or the countdown to my next stream which is really nice for a lot of people that pop on here so it's just right there everybody can see it and then something that's really fun that I added is just a way for people to interact with you during a live stream so again I'm not streaming right now but these are some of the um, things that you can click on there's a leaderboard section so currently right now um, one of my little cousins well he's not technically my little cousin yet but pretty much one of my little cousins he's my number one 
um, top user for these and they can use bits which bits give you money one bit is equal to one cent um, so depending on how you set it up that's how that's gonna work but this is just one thing that you know people can play so we turn the volume up a little bit and then I'm not streaming right now so you're not gonna be able to play it on the stream but and his name is John C okay so that's just one of the options that you know you can play there's a whole bunch of different ones that you can choose from to put on here I have two pages this is another one that's really fun that I like to play Run. See, it's just it's a fun way to interact with the streamer, and it's a fun way for me to get into it. Um, I don't know. It's just a blast. So that's number five, setting up some extensions. And if you want to look for more, you just click on the little edit panel, click on the plus. All right, I lied. So this is what you have to do. Instead of doing clicking on the edit panels like I just said, what you're going to do is go to customize channel. And then down here, there's a button in your creator dashboard that says extensions. You're going to click on that. And then you're going to scroll down and you're just going to look through all of these. I found most of mine in extension for games. My extensions, these are what I have so far. I can put my Fortnite stats up, but I'm pretty sure you can only have three extensions. So pick and choose what you want. If I want to throw in my Fortnite stats so you guys can see everything that I have on Fortnite, I'm not that good, so I don't really want to put those in there. But there's emojis and some other stuff. So this is what I have installed if I want to activate it. You just click on whatever you want to activate, and then if I set it as panel 3, it's going to take this one out, and then this just transfers over to here where you guys can't see it, but then you'll be able to see my Fortnite stats. Alright, if you found this video helpful and you want to see more like it, hit that thumbs up button, hit the subscribe if you haven't already, and click the bell notification so you don't miss anything new in the future. I'm Jason, as always, happy streaming, this is the Stream Experiment, we'll see you next time. I ripped the one guy. Shoot the banana on top. Knock the banana, knock the banana. Okay. Two guys left. Oh, let's get in there. The marauders are gonna muck him. Let the marauders muck him. Oh, I'm getting dummied. Who am I getting? What am I? Oh, I'm getting hit by those. They threw those f***ing things. They're almost all dead, they're almost all dead. I think that banana yeah. got revived, so be careful. Son of a b I'm down below you. Me, me, me. The here. banana is? Yeah, they're both up here. I need to get help. Can you all hold right. them down for a sec? I'm gonna drink my chug. Alright, alright. I'm just gonna sit up top. I'm gonna let them heal up too, I guess. We're just gonna get him. Hopefully that shark doesn't so mark me. Then. He's not, he's not. Just when you get that off, we gotta get after these guys. Oh get no. Oh no! Told you that f***ing f***ing shark. Just get away. God Get away from me! Should I rip this down? No, no, I'm up here. Alright. It's, it's pretty sturdy, just get up here with me. They're literally chilling down there, they're scared shitless. They're down here by me? Yeah, you don't hear them, they're hiding. Oh, they're right below me. The shark is gonna rip everything down. Yeah, he is. He's on the ground. Right. Right on me. Knock, knock him. The other guy's over here. Yeah. Oh yeah, you did! <laughs> One pump to the Let's face. go! <laughs> oh, I feel good now. I feel good. <laughs> <laughs> I told you I needed you flying right there. What did I even? Get? I got three kills that whole game. <laughs>